work on. Welcome to the Denison University post-game presser for game three of the NCAA Division III Granville Regional. Here with Milliken, head coach. Coach, just talk a little bit about today and obviously not the result that you wanted, but just kind of talk about what you saw. Yeah, uh, two teams played a good baseball game today and I thought a lot of guys um, for both teams, you could tell they left it on the field and that's what you're supposed to be doing in elimination games. So i um, proud of our team and a lot of respect for the Hanover team. They fought hard. I thought it was a seesaw game early and then it just kind of settled into not much happening or no big hits, I should say. A lot of guys on base, uh, but no big hits. That was the story of the game. Yeah. So yesterday we talked about, you know, in that ninth inning, you all battled back, were able to get the tying run on base. Here you had the winning run on base, mm -hmm. and then that last play happened. Yeah, it was an amazing play. Yep. I mean, you put, you know, we put ourselves in this position, um, having the chase, um, didn't come up with a big play earlier in the game, and some poor execution on our part, and uh, gave them an opportunity to make an amazing play, and kudos to the kid, he did a great job. So back in 2021, you all hosted Denison in your regional yeah. over there. I think it was the, the first regional for you all. Yep. Flash forward two years later now, you're here playing at Denison. You know, talk a little bit about the growth of your program and how you want to start you know, making that expectation that regionals is going to yeah. be something you're going to do every year. Um, part of what makes it so hard right now is, I mean, every year is hard, but there's 15 seniors um, on that field and playing, and they've seen two regionals in their career and prior to them there's never been a regional appearance in Millican history so I'm really proud of the program we built um, the kids are amazing I love our kids to death and uh, it truly is a family and they come want to be a part of it and so I'm proud of what we did we got to figure out that next step a little bit but uh, keep getting there as part of the journey as well and I think our guys are up for that and um, the expectation where I talk about the expectation of the program always raising up and you know, when I first got there, it was just win some games, and that was the expectation. Then it was win the conference, and that was the expectation. And now the expectation is make a regional. And um, I think we control a little better. We belong, but I think uh, we've proven that over the years that we're we're a top team, and uh, we need to continue to do that. And so I'm really proud of the guys in the program. So last question: Just talk. Have a message, you know, either for the fans or your, the support of your administration. You know, trying to build that program, like you said. I mean, the Workman family and what they supported and did to build our facilities, um, and the families to trust their kids with me, um, and Milliken to guide these kids and give us the the tools, the people, the the money, and everything to be able to do stuff like this and perform on this level is amazing. Um, I'm really proud to be a part of Milliken Athletics and Milliken University, and I thank everybody for the support. I'll give you one. Um, Go ahead. You mentioned the 15 seniors on your roster this year. I've been the just last year. I've been the senior that lost their last baseball game in the playoffs. I've been in that in that spot. What message do you have to them going forward? And what do you have to say to them about the imprint that they put on this team? You mentioned that they were the ones that got here. That you guys have never been to the region before. This is a class that helped produce that as well. What do you have to say to them? Yeah, I think right now it's hard to process some of that stuff. I just told the guys. There was a lot of tears, and myself included. Um, those thoughts come later. You know, before we made the playoff run in our conference tournament, um, I had all the seniors over and we just kind of talked about what life is going to look like after baseball. And there's going to be a lot of successful people. Very few of them are going to be playing baseball. And so there's a lot of successful kids on that field today, both sides, Hanover and ourselves. And that's what these kids do as student athletes. Um, this is just a part of your journey. It's not the whole journey. And so um, I'm excited to follow these guys and see how successful they are in the next step. Thanks, Coach. Appreciate it. Yep.